Meanwhile, music fans are mourning the loss of the celebrated Taiwanese composer Li Taixiang. Li, the creator of classic hits such as The Olive Tree and Farewell, died in his sleep on Thursday night in New Taipei. He was 72. At an Executive Yuan Awards ceremony last April, Li Taishan's struggles were apparent. His body was frail and he couldn't speak, but his passion for music showed through. The composer used body language to express joy at winning the prestigious National Cultural Award. Li's battle against illness ended last night at the Buddhist Zhuqi General Hospital in Xindian. He was 72. One of Li's family members announced the news. I regret to say that my brother passed away at 8.20 this evening. He died in his sleep with his family by his side. <laughs> Lee based his masterpiece The Olive Tree on a work by the Taiwanese author Echo and had the Taiwanese singer Chiyu give voice to the song. The result made him an icon. <laughs> On the surface, it is a love song, said Lee. But what this love song really shows is my attachment to ideals. I am still carrying out the ideals manufactured in folk songs, a process that brings me great joy. Lee was an Amis Aboriginal born in Taidong in 1941. His early training was in artistic prints, but he switched to music for the sake of a girl. The money Lee's father earned as a hunter paid for his violin studies. Lee's music crossed between classical and popular. Without any royalties earned on covers of his work, Lee spent the last two decades of his life fighting both sickness and debt. News of his death has left a deep longing in the music world.